Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to the channel, y'all. Melanie Gemini, Mr. Tarot, back at you again. Y'all, I don't know, I've been waking up at in between 2 and 4, or sometimes 2 and 2.30 and 3, or close to 2. I don't know, maybe I went to sleep early, I don't know, I was tired, but when I had that food, boy, look, I ain't gonna lie, I had that trap gas, but boy, look. When everything was released, I was released to sleep. <laughs> but y'all, I was also called to get up this morning because um, I had, uh, you know, one of the family members in Melanie and Gemini, Mr. Chiro, had hit me up because of, um, you know, the being absorbed. You know what I'm saying? You can absorb yourself by giving too much time giving too much love, giving too much understanding to excuses. Understand this. When you're in a relationship with someone and y'all both have agreed to this and y'all understand what this is, then move accordingly. But some is telling me that there may be a few Geminis that are up that have been waking up at a certain time. And um, y'all, I get a lot of energy of people are in like and you may be in a head space right now but it's nothing that you cannot you know fix nothing god cannot fix you know what i'm saying um i'm getting the energy of a, a lot of it's like things are not as bad as they seem anymore like you were really worried for nothing but it's like you're like an on time type of person so when it went so being that you're an on time type of person the energy that people give is not on time and it agitates you you know what i'm saying because you feel that if you can be an on-time person they can be an on-time person as well you feel like they take your time as if you are not worthy of importance like like what who you are is you know what i'm saying you're not important y'all i'm um finna talk and you know get the cards laid out real good i'm finna get six cards of the first one then I'm going to get clarification cards for these, y'all. Y'all, I also had an energy. I, it's like, y'all, I'm trying to remember my dreams, but y'all, someone's telling me to get a um, a dream catcher. You know what I'm saying? Like, to catch whatever and whoever is probably trying to stop me from dreaming or whatever situation may be. But I know that god sent me here and put me in here for a reason and i'm not going to be in a situation and let my gift go to waste a lot of people do not want me doing this y'all i'm telling you so many people do not <clears throat> like me doing this y'all at all but this it's like it's almost like me telling someone oh i don't like you practicing the bible or i don't i don't like you practicing the book of quran or i don't you know what i'm saying you know, I'm. that's not me. I respect everybody's religion. Just respect mine. Respect that I believe in God. Respect that I believe that God talks to me who is the higher source. And God brings things to me. Y'all understand. 333 three, three on the clock. When you're in a situation, when you're in a situation where, when you're in a situation, y'all, where you don't put all your faith and all your trust in God, you can give a fuck. Because at the end of the day, it's people that's gonna try to test to see if 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 you if you if this is just something that you do, y'all. This is not nothing that I fucking do. This is something that I live by. You know what I'm saying? Protecting my energy, helping others, being a blessing to others, giving to others with a pure heart. You know what I'm saying? One thing I always remember is y'all give with a pure heart, but do not be no damn fool real talk so y'all let's get into the message let's see what six cards came out let's see what needs to be said and then it says listening for truth so someone may have woken up or you know um number 36 y'all been getting 36 a lot or something is or someone's birthday is june 3rd or somebody's birthday is june 18th moving forward someone is listening to or uh, listening for truth or someone is silencing and being calm and just sitting back and watching so they can listen to what is going on moving forward inspiration so you're listening to higher up you're listening to higher source you're listening to god and 
you're getting inspiration by what's going on and what you're seeing and the things that are being done to you for you to move forward. Honestly, whatever bad happens to you, you that fuels you to give, go even harder. I'm telling y'all, it's so many roadblocks that have been put in my way. You know what I'm saying? Stopping going false. You know what I'm saying? Bullshit going on with y'all. It just fueled my flame to keep on going because ain't nothing going to get in the way. I'm just going to find a better way to do it. <clears throat> Moving forward, conscious connection. You're having conscious connection with your higher self and the higher ups. It's the fact that, that's you know what I'm saying, we're called to do this. And it can be any time of the night. You know what I'm saying? Any time of the morning. When we're called, we're called. You know what I'm saying? Moving forward. Every journey starts with a single step. So y'all need to take that step. If you're you're getting nudges and inspiration to do something moving forward, you need to do that. And then I'm getting something about Pandora's gift. There's a gift that is like you seeing differently. You know what I'm saying? And then I'm getting something about maybe 45, maybe a significance. You maybe have a 12-year-old. You may be born... February 1st, you know someone born um, February 1st, or you have Aquarius in your chart, um, and or some saying Aries, and then um, getting maybe 35, 36, 25, and then y'all, I'm getting release the dark wounds, let love live. So, y'all, this is one thing stop allowing the things that people do you know what i'm saying like stop allowing what people do to dictate how you go treat other people just move accordingly forgive fuck an apology and move forward you know what i'm saying because when you start accepting shit that's when they start leaping you know what i'm saying gallivanting and and and, and jumping and hopping and back flipping on your ass. And sometimes, you know what, for me to say out loud, you know, something that I caught, like I kept allowing people to do what the fuck they wanted to do. And it's like, you know what I'm saying? Just so that there won't be you no know, hollering, yelling, and calamity, but it just never really got me nowhere. Being self self pleasing other people and, and lighting myself on fire just to keep them warm. Fuck it, that and them. Moving for word y'all someone's telling me to pull some more cards i guess this is the message but y'all um i'm gonna get up in the morning and or i'm gonna get up um and go to work and then get there and do a message but just i was just called to do a message and when i'm called to do a message and when i'm called to pull more cards <laughs> and it's that moving forward restore and replenish you're being restored and you're being replenished it's so many obstacles and i'm proud of you and it's like a lot of people do not congratulate you pat you on the back and of course they be like oh you know what i'm saying but god you know what i'm saying he blesses us he gives us things 818 on the clock and when we go through things and we're working on ourselves and we're figuring out ourselves and figuring out how we can live our lives better instead of trying to help people live their lives better until we know how to fully live our lives better and then swept in front of our front porches before we swept and help anybody else and ask to sweep in front of their front porch before we sit around here and sweep in front of it. Moving forward, and then I'm getting heaven sent. So y'all, inspiration or whatever you had going on is heaven sent. Because if you weren't going through these situations and if you didn't have inspiration to keep going, you would have stopped. And I feel like it's your higher self that kept you going, y'all. I'm telling you, I it's like I jump from different places when I'm just sitting down. I could be literally sitting down and I meet my higher self either at a bus station or I meet them inside the train or something like that. And it's weird. And when they come to me, they give me things. And when they give me or when this higher self gives me something, it helps with what I have going on now. And honestly, being it, I did my quantum jump for seven days and, 
You know what I'm saying? I still remember it. I know that God has a blessing for me. I know that the universe is working in my favor because I'm putting good positive energy out there. I'm putting, you know what I'm saying? Giving energy, understanding energy, sacrifice. You feel me? And I know God sees that. And I know I'm continuously keep going because God is not going to put me in a weird situation to where I'm around here fucked up. Thank you, God, Spirit, God, and Archangels. Then I'm getting big, bold vision. Someone has a big, bold vision, you know, but it takes a step, y'all. You know what I'm saying? People like to scare you up. Well, you need this, and you need that, and you need this, and you need that. How are you going to do this without this, God? Because God going to make everything. If I show works of what I want, it's all going to come. And then I'm getting... In the world, not of the world. So it's the fact that we're are we are guided with conscious conscious connection from higher, and people don't understand that. People think that we're crazy. People think you know what I'm saying. There's something wrong with us. People think that we ain't wrapped tight. But guess what? It's always the people that ain't fucking wrapped tight and then told somebody some shit that was supposed to happen and told them to be aware of something. And, it, and you were aware and you became aware, but see, they ain't aware unless it's more, more you know what I'm saying, beneficial to them. Make it make sense, y'all. Some people will stop fucking with you. Some people will stop calling you because, you know what I'm saying, they got their things going on, but they know, but, but then when things get too damn tough and they know who to come to, they decide to come back to source. It just, it's just weird, like the same sign that y'all are going going you know what i'm saying it may be water sign earth signs and them fucking fire signs it's always a pacific and it may even be a a, a a like sign like us it's always a pacific sign that always does some weird shit or they always show that they codependent but they you know what i'm saying they it's like they codependent but then they want to be independent at the same time you need to choose you know what i'm saying choose if you ain't trying to choose then stay the fuck away from me because i'm a truth in choice you know what i'm saying truth and choice it damn near signed alike because it all go together in this bitch moving forward y'all let's get some more messages then i'm getting the perfection of your life you're perfecting your life you're giving you're being given the pandora's gift or you're being given a gift to a different life opening up your mind to different things because guess what the perfection of your life you're perfecting your life you're not trying to perfect nobody else's life right now you can help because god sends you to help to help people perfect because you know certain things about the perfection that they do not have or understand yet but sometimes y'all hmm, moving forward y'all last card power of attraction your power of attraction is what you are attracting if you're attracting fuck niggas you gonna get one if you attracting a weak bitch you gonna get one if you're attracting liars stealers all that then that is what you attract but you have to protect your energy that's why i protect my energy i know plenty of people envy me i know plenty of people want my body i know plenty of people you know what i'm saying won't 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 want my mind won't the fact that people love me won't that energy that people give me and the energy that i get from the collective it is very appreciated y'all moving forward let's get into the messages again y'all i'm getting the grand reaper y'all i'm getting relationships is over no second chances grow transform your life you have separated yourself from a relationship because they you it's, it's it's clearly showing that you are growing when it's clearly showing that you are growing i promise you it's going to show you through action it's going to is you know what i'm saying these people going to show you in action when they going to do something that they know that is not following according to you know what's going on and then y'all i'm getting another energy with looking at this car is the relationship is over it's been over it's just someone is delusional and holding on and when you hold on it's like you hurting yourself you holding on to something that don't want to be held on to if you got to damn near pull your arm out of socket to hold on to something is it's different to it's the difference between holding hands and holding on holding on to somebody with dear life moving forward 
And y'all, another thing I get from this card is growing and transforming your life. You have to grow and transform your life, 1444. Stop allowing people, places, and things to stop you from making decisions that's going to help you grow for you. Stop allowing, be like, well, if I'm not with this person, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to have that. What the fuck is wrong with you? I tell people, these be the same people that go to church every Sunday and they be like, I don't know what I'm going to do. He's this and he's that and, 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 and he's doing his own thing and he's not supporting me. The only person that's supposed to be supporting you is God. I don't give a fuck if you in a relationship or not. When you know that you have God supporting you and he's going to give and bring the people that are supposed to, to support you and stay down and see one thing that people don't understand is people got with certain people from circumstances making it make sense people got with people because of circumstances they didn't get with people because of them unconditionally loving them they got into a situation with them because of money sex attraction not the real thing that's just physical that's passion that's desire that's not oh what they mind like intellectually how are they you know what I'm saying? You know, moving forward. Like, how are they? How do they act? Who are they for real? Have they, you know what I'm saying? Are they so bright and, and they expose who they are for good and for bad? And then let's see who come with them. That's something, another energy I'm hearing. Like, someone that exposes themselves that has no nothing hidden about them, but then there are some that will hide in the darkness because of how and who they are. Moving forward, y'all, I'm getting palm tree stability, security, performance, growth, endurance, flexibility. See, you're working on yourself and you're getting flexibility. And this is the palm tree, y'all. You're getting, you know what I'm saying, security. You know what I'm saying? You're getting more growth. You're getting more performance. You're getting more will to do things, y'all. And I'm telling you that real talk. It's been, it's been many times where I just felt like, I, 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 how am I going to do this? How am I going to do that? And I stopped doing it. I was like, man, God finna get me through, clean through. And then I'm getting stabbed in the back, y'all. So after being stabbed in the back, y'all, and after this heartbreak, after this pain, after this separation, after this sep um this deception and shocking attacks or whatever somebody did or someone attacked you or however, whatever the situation be, you cut that shit short. You dead in that situation and you took it for what it is. Now God is blessing you, y'all. My left ear is ringing. Y'all, my ears, like, y'all, I hear frequencies. And the frequencies was crazy this morning. Like, when I get up, and honestly, I've been hearing frequencies like that since I was young. But I just, I just never really understood because my family, I don't know. But I know my grandmother, she knows stuff about that. But she never let family know because of the judgment that was going to be put amongst her. But it's something about my Auntie Anne. I remember her. She wasn't um, born into the family, but it was somebody that my grandma hung out with. <clears throat> Thank you, God, Spirit, God, and Archangels, and the ancestors for the collective message of Gemini. Thank you, God, Spirit, God, and Archangels for the collective message of Gemini. I'm getting y'all reminiscing, keepsakes, perception, learn from the past, make memories. So, y'all, your past and what you have going on makes the memories to move forward, to follow your dreams, to, top, to stop sitting there waiting for someone who is not waiting on you. If there's going to be someone that is not waiting on you and constantly stabbing you in the fucking back, you're going to stay there and we not. Moving forward, I'm getting sunglasses, watching, looking, stalking, gaslighting, perception, uh, focusing out so someone's focusing on their stability someone's focused on you know making life better for themselves um you know what i'm saying it's just the focus for me y'all the focus for me is the higher focus is something that's going to help better you your family just you know what i'm saying generational wealth that's what I'm feeling. You know what I'm saying? Generational wealth for me is your children being knowing, being able to come to a house that the family, like you're going to have that house where people can come. Your family, your children, and they children. And you'll be able to have something built to where when your children's children to be straight. 
they ain't gonna never have to worry about nothing like you're living you're gonna leave a legacy that your parents didn't i'm sorry and i'm being honest my mama did not leave me a legacy my father did not leave me a legacy i don't even i think my my father's ashamed of me and i'm the firstborn i was the secret child no one knew about sometimes we get tired of being secret and we want to come into the light moving forward snake energy y'all snake energy content um um competition um enemies and i'm getting clever malicious look over your shoulder ass energy y'all the other woman so someone stabbed you in your back with the other woman y'all someone stabbed you in the back with the other woman other man you moving forward but then sometimes it still hurts i'm gonna tell you something when you still in a situation with somebody, but y'all not in a relationship with each other, trust and believe it gets hard because even though y'all are not together, you live in a part emotionally, but physically you're together. That is delusion. That is rosy colored glasses. That is illusion. It's making your mind feel that there may be something, but in actuality, it is not. You have to move accordingly to how your cards are dealt. If you're not going to move accordingly to how your cards are dealt, you're giving the energy in the universe mixed emotions. You both are. Someone has to figure it out. If someone has to put someone needs to learn to let go. And sometimes people that it's hard for things to let go is things that you can't part with, things that you can't get rid of. It cannot be all the way down to the oldest sweatshirt you have, all the way down to the favorite pair of pants you got. And that's on some real shit. Or it can even be an object because it's the feeling of having something that's not going to leave you and having control if it stays or if it goes y'all make that make sense and i feel the spirit talking to me when he says that that's what hurts so much when you cannot let things go and if you are trying to learn how to let things go learn by letting things go that you really don't need but you want moving forward i'm getting self-indulgence y'all that focus on self self-worth y'all time to heal show work self appreciation show yourself appreciation y'all show yourself self-love if you need a self-love ritual kit i have that for you and that kit is 50 dollars, y'all i'm telling y'all stop allowing other people to make decisions for you indirectly two 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 on the clock if someone's showing you fuck telling you if someone's showing you what this is if a person is not communicating with you emotionally physically and mentally y'all are in a karmic relationship if someone has to hide who they are from you because they're scared of 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 or being exposed for who they are not for you moving forward i'm getting kisses unconditional loving giving and receiving um affection falling in love so someone from this energy right here that is watching you and stalking you or however the situation may be it's going to be always unconditional love there but you have to understand how to move accordingly unconditional love with a toxic person can put you in a situation to fall don't get me wrong you can talk to them on the phone and if they ever talk about something oh when you're gonna see me soon and soon can be sooner than later but you have to make them understand that this is not that type of relationship where you're gonna be in a relationship and y'all gonna like they need you 23 33 on the clock they it's it's they just trying to sneak back in and this snake gonna stab you in the motherfucking back but you need to stab this snake you know what i'm saying and kill it and dead that where it is y'all moving forward talking interested conversing more awaited messages arriving texts calls emails and how y'all is these these snakes trying to call you they trying to text you they trying to get in contact with you but sometimes if it's not if if it's not meant for you to god will bring you to whoever needs to be hot got talk whatever you know what i'm saying making it make sense 
Stop allowing people to be in your energy. Because, but y'all, being that you've been self-loving and you've been ending things and all of that, y'all, y'all been doing what you're supposed to be doing for you, doing things that make you feel good, y'all. You're getting abundance. Keep the position. Keep the mindset. Manifest exactly what you want gratitude and bliss so y'all i'm telling you once you get out of this fucked up energy god has so much other shit for you people are trying to figure out oh how are you getting this 24 44 on the clock it's the fact that i'm being protected it's the fact that i'm being balanced it's the fact that i'm balancing myself it's the fact that i'm trying to you know what i'm saying put myself in a situation to help other people balance their self because they're lost and they trying to figure out how to get through it i've been married twice y'all and the first time i got married was to help a friend of mine because i know how that shit feels and when i got married the second time i thought it was real and it wasn't it was the fact that i was helping people lighting myself on fucking fire just to keep them warm fuck that it and them him and them you know what I'm saying? Moving forward, I'm getting soulmates. In reverse, it's not your soulmate, y'all. This is this is not a soul connection. This is a false person. This is a false partnership. This is a false agreement. False a contract. So y'all, this person is very you're you're y'all it's the fact that y'all you're a strong person your will your will is stronger than a lot of people it's the fact that you can come up and show up in somebody's life ground yourself and 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 and, and show up and show out and make and make people that they around look fucking bad you can be a good parent you can be a good worker you can pay your bills and you can do this and you do that and people will be envious of that shit and try to fucking stop you because they are not fucking there yet and it's the fact that they feel that they can slow you down that they can hurry up and get to where the fuck they you know what i'm saying and then they can beat you but some people will try to trip you the fuck up just so that they can win and i mean that people will do booty box kitchen magic just to trip you up but don't know that you hop skipped and god was with you for you to leap and go to towards your dreams y'all golden mirror y'all self-absorbed narcissist one-sided relationship love bombing this may be someone that love bomb you coming in tell you sweet nothings and it's not true and or someone's doing mirror magic to be you they trying to do mirror magic to take from you but they cannot do it i'm telling you you cannot do this to people who are high priestesses who people who connect and protect their energy last card is y'all paradise happiness um expansion joy playfulness oneness enjoy each other or so this may be that or you're enjoying yourself you are a twin gemini so you're enjoying yourself you're enjoying the the shit that people try to do to you these snake ass energies fuck them him them all along because guess what god got you peace i'll see y'all later good night good morning good evening